If you guys are looking for cheap Microsoft points or PSN codes, then make sure to check out my sponsor, G2A. They also sell codes for all the latest games at a discount price. You can find the link in the description. Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome to a FIFA 20 sniping reaction video. Today, we have got an icon special. This just includes icon sniping clips, and to be honest, probably one of the best opportunities that I'll get all year, and also my best snipe in terms of profit after tax, around 500,000 coins on just one card. So an absolutely insane episode for you guys. Probably gonna be one of the best sniping reaction videos that I produce um, regarding FIFA 20. So if you guys do enjoy, please smash the like button. Let's see if kind of 1,000 likes. Normally I go for like between 350 and 500, but considering this video has took me almost one month to complete and gather the clips for, it would be greatly appreciated if we could hit 1,000 likes. Also, guys, if you're on your channel as well, make sure to subscribe. Now, the content that you guys are going to see in today's video was, in fact, recorded on both Xbox and PlayStation. So, variety of different markets explored. And I do, in fact, get myself successful snipes on both consoles as well. Um, really good profit made on both of my different accounts. So, hopefully, you guys will enjoy today's episode. Anyway, though, we have to jump into this content as it is absolutely incredible. Sure, you guys are going to love it. Um, other than that, though... Let's just roll the clips and hopefully you guys enjoy. <gasps> I've actually completely bossed that up. That's so bad. But the thing is, I didn't even bid on it in time. It's a min price Maldini. Gee, that's actually crazy. 88 rated. I know it's baby, but that's still like one of the best fullbacks on the game. Oh my days. Guys, that went so quick though. I couldn't even bid on it in time. 66, 500. I'm not even trying to get min price icons. Brilliant. He's like 500k. He is in excess of 500,000 coins. And we've just missed him at min price. Like I mentioned, boys, I'm not even trying to get min price icons. Just trying to do defenders. The generic sniping filter for icons is just too competitive. So I've decided to, to switch things up. And I'm just trying to get them below 265k. That's the last thing I was expecting to see. I didn't expect to see Maldini. That's crazy, but the fact, unfortunately, guys, that he was min price there as a list means that even for the generic sniping filter, he would have appeared as an icon. So that's probably not helped us out. If that card was like 165k, I guess we would have been able to snipe that, you know. But the fact that he appeared at min price is, one, a great opportunity, and two, kind of unfortunate because it means that he falls under like the generic sniping filter. So we've missed out on a decent attempt there. Nice! We finally get one! We have finally got ourselves an icon! Of course it's going to be a defender. Petit is one of the cheap ones though to be fair guys. 288k? Might be able to get close to 300,000 to be fair guys but... Hey, you know what? After so long of searching, I ain't even going to complain about getting somebody that's not maybe the greatest snipe ever. They are around 280. Bit more maybe. As you can see, a couple of petits up at around 285,000 coins. But to be fair, guys, like, that's still a decent snipe. What was that, 211,000? Let's go check it out. I think it was 211. Yeah, correct. So, again, even after tax, we'll make, like, probably 50k after tax. Maybe a bit more, actually. That's not bad. The thing is, though, boys, it's just an icon snipe. I've been working so hard to get these over, like, the past couple of weeks. And it's taken so long. Really has. That's a decent one. Even if it is just 50k, I'll still take it. Good content. And realistically, we ain't going to complain about profits. So, probably listed up at around 285,000 coins to be fair, guys. And we'll keep sniping and go on to the next one. <gasps> no way! No way! That's just not happened. That, oh my god. I'm just trying to snipe like Roberto, Carlos, Rivaldo. Something like that. 175k for Socrates? Are you mental? That's not even his baby card. That's the best one that's out at the moment. Like, primes are still two weeks away. What is the damage here? What is the damage? Of course he's above a million coins, isn't he? Why not? Oh my god. 1.16. Mate, somebody's missed out of one. 175,000? 
why would they have a list it around that? They're probably trying to list it up at like 1.175. That's honestly insane, guys. That is probably one of the best sniping opportunities that I will see all year. Doesn't matter how long I spend sniping now till the end of the year. Probably not seeing an opportunity as good as that. That's ridiculous, man. That would have been so good for content. Could you imagine if we would have got that? I know that we missed out on a Ronaldinho like a month ago. Oh my god, that would have been mental. I can't believe this, guys. Like, on this Brazilian sniping filter, right, it's so slow. It's a bad filter. Don't get me wrong. But the opportunities are there. Imagine if we would have got that card. I would have been calling it the greatest sniping filter known to man. That's actually incredible that we had the opportunity there to get a card. One million coins under. Guys, we will take it. Even if it is just Rivaldo. 380,000 coins. Not the greatest snipe in the world. Don't get me wrong, but this Brazilian sniping filter, man, it is hard work. 380,000 coins for baby Rivaldo. Personally, I'd never use him. Two star weak foot, like for me, just makes him unusable. But we'll be up to selling for about... In excess of 425. So after tax, we're probably. I'm, pr I'm probably going to list them up a little bit over that. 430 maybe. After tax, what's that? About 30,000 coins? I, I don't know. Like, I'm so bad at working out tax. I know it's only 5%, guys. Whatever. Doesn't matter. It's still going to be profit, though. And it's still going to be like a decent amount of it as well. Um, Honestly, though, but I I've been going on this Brazilian icon sniping filter for so long. We saw like a. Um, Socrates 80 is 89 mid version like this sniping filter is so dry but I suppose um as we as we saw with Socrates there is a chance to get some of the really big icons Rivaldo unfortunately not really one of them but it's still profit after tax and again boys just another successful icon clip to put into a sniping reactions video oh no what have I done Guys, I'm actually surprised that we got that. Wait, what? This is on the PlayStation, mate. You shouldn't be allowed to do that on the PlayStation. I'll take it, though. Carlos Puyol, not bad. Not bad, boys. Um, back to doing Defenders. This time, though, on a different console. These cards are around 230k. Honestly, guys, I was expecting them to be a bit more than that. Like, 235 is the standard price of these icons. I will probably list that up a little bit more. Probably, um, considering I bought that for 214, I reckon I'll be able to sell it for like 238 to 235, something like that. Somewhere in that vicinity. Nonetheless, though, guys, like, I'm very surprised that I got that snipe, especially on the PlayStation. For those of you that do not know, this console is like 10 times more competitive than the Xbox. Um, so there's more opportunities, but there's more people sniping as well. So there's technically less chance of getting the card, even if you see more of them. That time round, I messed up the mechanics and I was still able to buy the icon. It's still a snipe, right? Like, it's just the fact that we did load in directly on the one hour mark. I just done the mechanics incorrectly, but fortunately was able to recover and still get this icon. That's my first one, the PlayStation. Um, for, for sniping reactions, anyway. I, I've sniped an icon in terms of trading from scratch, which I do on the PlayStation. But for sniping reactions, my very first one on the PlayStation 4. No way! <laughs> Wait, what? That's Zambrotta! He's elite tier, right, guys? Isn't this a god tier fullback? 86 rated. I don't care about the rating, mate. We just got him for 159k. Guys, this is Zambrotta. That's unbelievable on the PlayStation. I'm telling you guys, like, PlayStation sniping is OP. 670k. I thought he was in excess of 500. That's mental. That's one of my best snipes of the year. Hands down. I've just got him for 159k on my birthday. Christmas Eve. It is a Christmas miracle. It really is. Zambrotta. He sells for 670,000 coins. That's unbelievable. I'm going to make mad profit after tax on this snipe. This is definitely one of my best snipes of the year. Definitely. Like, not even... No competition. I know we got a Rivaldo near to the start of FIFA 20, but... This is just as good, guys. This is like, this is crazy. It really is insane. And on the PlayStation as well, which to me is kind of important. It makes me, 
it, it goes to show that I can in fact compete on this console and get some of the best snipes that do arise. Oh, that's ridiculous, mate. 120k for a petite? That is... Nah, this is stupid. This is stupid. Only a couple of days ago, we got a diff knife, and now today we get petite. Oh, I, lo I love it, guys. PlayStation sniping is insane. Don't get me wrong, the market is well down. So he's on, like, 220,000 coins. But that's 100k on the boys. I'll go show you guys now. 220. Couple of them available at this price, to be fair. One there at 215, but lads, I don't care. This is insane. Like, the sniping that we've had recently on the PlayStation has been mental. Um, 235 that we sold that card for, and Zambrotter a few days ago for 680. And now, this time round, we get a petite for 120,000 coins, which is 100k under. PlayStation sniping's been insane for me, guys. I definitely need to produce more content in this account. 1 million percent. And the coins will help me as well on the PlayStation. Like, you guys might see that the record, um, I don't actually have any games played. That's because on this console, I only play, like, Squad Builder Showdown, 7-Minute Squad, stuff like that. So I do play games on this console, and I do need the coins. It just, I play against friends in, um, like, YouTube series. So having the extra coins and trading on this account is very beneficial. And this 100k, it'll definitely help me out, because that is, in fact... 100,000 coins under right there on a petite for 120k. It ain't Zambrotta level. I don't think we'll get another one of them this year, but it's still a snipe that I'm very happy with.